No, 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 come on, you stupid bird, no! Ah, oh, you stupid bird! <laughs> on heroes welcome back to the vlog so today is vivian's day off she went to go pick up the girls and i have no idea where they disappeared to which means that i'm home alone i mean i do have the dogs here and the cats but essentially i'm home alone now i have to figure out what to do today because the, our plans completely went out the window we were supposed to do the challenge today but since they took off somewhere else i have no idea so i gotta go out and figure out what to do earlier this week we were supposed to take the dogs down to the beach but unfortunately because emma was taking so long doing her homework we completely lost the entire day and we were only able to take them to the park so today since it's really hot it's basically 92 degrees um i decided to take them down to the beach so that they can get nice and wet because check them out they are big struggling right there and i have the air blasting just on the feet so that they can get all the cold air as possible but they're still hot so i decided to take them out of the house just so that they can get out i'm going to take them down to the beach and then from there we do need to go to petco because biscuit does need some stuff so that's the plan for right now i'm not exactly sure what's going to happen beyond that but that's the plan for right now I also brought the drone because i wanted to get some super sweet shots from being overhead while we we're at the beach so they'll be able to integrate it into this vlog i always love this view from here Look at how gorgeous this looks. Every single time this view gets me. Look at that. And you see the lighthouse way over there. It looks absolutely gorgeous from here. It's picture perfect, basically. All right, let's make our way down. Usually when we come, we go to the right over there where the rocks are at. But this time I decided to go to the left over there where the sand is. And it's basically like a little beach. And this way they'll be able to run a little bit better rather than being stuck on the rock. So I'm going to head to the left. It's a little bit more tricky because... There's like a weirdness over there and then she has to, they have to go over those big boulders but it should be fine because like I said, there's sand over there and they'll be able to run a little bit more free compared to over here where the rocks are at. You guys see what I mean? Look at all these boulders. It makes it very difficult for the dogs to go through here and it makes it especially difficult for Clementine to come through here. So that's one of the main reasons why we avoid coming this way because of the difficulty of all these rocks and boulders. Come on, Victor. Let me see. All right, go, 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 go. They see? Go! You're free! So this section right here is like a little beach, but it doesn't go all the way around. So kind of halfway over there, getting to where the lighthouse is at, it cuts off. But it's a lot of sand right here and it allows them to kind of really, really be able to run. Honestly, I wish Clementine was a little bit bigger and had a little bit more stability and wasn't as clumsy. That way we would be able to bring her down here where she would be able to have fun and actually run rather than being at the rocks. But unfortunately, she's just way too clumsy to come up through all those rocks. You can see up behind, there's a bunch of rocks and they're very big boulders. So it just makes it way too difficult and way too dangerous for her. Meanwhile, they're doing their thing. I'm, I'm gonna toss this drone up into the sky and try to get some sweet shots because like I said, it's a very beautiful view from here, but getting a bird's eye view from up ahead, let's see how that looks. This is most definitely not what you want to happen when you throw your drone up. You do not want it to lose connection and you do not want it to crash against rocks or just fall into the ocean because then there goes all your money, there goes all your footage. But it seems that's where we're going now because it lost connection completely and it's trying to reconnect and it says it's hovering in place but unfortunately it's also showing me that I only have 9 minutes left on the battery. So I have no idea where it's at. I look like I'm smiling but honestly I'm really concerned, I'm really bothered by this right now. but. There's really nothing I can do, right? If it crashed up against the wall because it lost connection or if it just fell into the ocean, what can I do? The footage is gone, the drone is gone. So, <laughs> woo! No, 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 no! Come on, you stupid bird, no! Ah, oh, you stupid bird! And just like that, karma not found. Be sure karma is powered on. It fell out of the sky into those rocks over there. I'm gonna try to make my way over there, but I don't think I'm gonna find it. And if I do find it, it's probably all broken up. Ah! I haven't flown this drone in months. And the first time I decided to take it out to fly it, it loses signal in the middle of a flight and it falls out of the sky. What are the odds? What, <laughs> what are the odds? There goes the battery. Look at, oh no, you jackass drone. Yeah. I mean, two of the propellers are gone. But, but 
I have extra propellers in the car. Well, actually, I have extra propellers in the backpack. Let me find the actual GoPro itself. Hopefully, it has the footage. Let me put this to the side. Okay. Look at that. It still has the leg, the arms. It's just missing the propellers. So I have those. And then I just got to find this section with the GoPro. I have the battery here. Let's see if it still has... Well, it still does have battery. All right. And I have this. Let's go find the actual camera. So the drone fell somewhere right here. And I found the battery right next to it. But for some weird reason, the camera and everything else. And the little stabilizer is nowhere to be found. I've been looking for the last half hour in this entire section. Like I've covered this basically this entire section over here. And I can't find it anywhere. And I thought that maybe it fell over there and rolled down. But, but the that really doesn't make sense because why would the battery and the drone be right next to each other? That doesn't really make sense to me. But I, I checked up here as well and nothing. It's been about half an hour and I think I'm just going to call it. I do have that extra little piece and I do have another GoPro to go into the drone. But I kind of just wanted to get that footage. Well, at least I found the drone. That's what matters. Hopefully when I get home, I can try it again and hopefully it works. I think at this point, it's safe to say RIP GoPro Hero 5. You helped us a lot, you did a lot, you got us a lot of sweet footage throughout the years. R.I.P. Let's take a moment. Alright, let's head out. Look at these beautiful dogs. They followed me way over here to come try to find the remains of my drone. From way over there. You want that one? All right, look, we're gonna get two, right? Come on, this is all we came for, come on. We were originally gonna go to Petco, but then I remember that, that the Walmart is literally right next door. And this is basically all we were coming for, is these bones for biscuit. And right here at Walmart, they cost $2, whereas next door at Petco, they cost $6. So it only makes sense to come here and I can get two of them for cheaper than going next door. So one, two, three. <clears throat> all right, <Okay. gasps> Oh yeah, looks like it's working. Let's connect the controller. So everything seems to be turning on, but for some weird reason, the camera is not responsive. So even on here, see that? It identifies the drone and the stabilizer and the remote control, but for, what, for whatever reason, the, ca the camera just won't activate. Let's see if it'll do it. See, no camera found. I think what's happening is since it fell on the floor and this whole little um, stabilizer is a completely different one, I think I need to do an, a system update to be able to fix it off. But it still works. It still works. But anyways, um, I don't know if you guys know this, but the house is completely empty, which means Vivian is still not home. Um, she did text me while I was at the beach with the dogs that she's at her mom's house. So I'm not exactly sure what time she's going to get home, which, which is kind of good because this allows me to jump in the shower and complete, all relax and settle in. So there's nothing else that's going to kind of happen aside from me jumping in the shower, making myself some oatmeal and then sitting back and relax. So with that said, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to hit the like button. Make sure to subscribe and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.